We must restore harmony on the planet. The stars are tangled. Like lights, like Christmas lights can be tangled. Our projections from the stars are tangled. We need help. Battleship sunk. Like a light, bright battleship. All of the... It's just tangled. It's like a giant tangle. Big, giant, tangled ship. And once they're back, shining the way they're supposed to, only by vibrations, it's just raising your vibration, realizing your vibration as a number being measured, if you want to measure it that way, or know it as a feeling, then you can change your destiny for your next incarnation, if that's your plan. If you choose to die, you will die. If you choose to live forever, <laughs> you will live forever. It's all about the stars. Fixing our song. The rainbow stars project our vibrations. Imagine if they were all in one perfect harmony. How hard would it be to put that on the news? <laughs> Finding Nemo, 11 letters. Just keep swimming? How is that not a communication from the planet? How do you not see any movie or song as a communication from the planet? How can you not do that? Is it, is it just because you believe all of the people talking on TV? Trumpy? <laughs> all the silly people on TV, all the ones you believe exist, you know that extraterrestrials have access to Wi-Fi, <laughs> so do other planets. I live in Silicon Valley area where the world heart beats. This area holds the mystery spot, the doorway. <laughs> One day, people will pick up on the little joke we have going here and where all this madness and funness is coming from. <laughs> oh, we still don't get it. It's so cute. I love watching the news. It's hilarious. I love watching the numbers because you still don't believe that you're the child in the never-ending story. <laughs> you. My simulation's great, because I know exactly what's going on here. It's going good. Once all of our colors are in harmony, and we get this tangle out of our music hair, we'll be living the future. We'll be living the future. This is what we are. We're eternal. We will live forever. <laughs> but you can't listen to anybody else and you can't listen to Trump and you can't listen to your boss and you can't listen to the D words or the N words. Don't let anybody tell you the N word. I even tell my little three-year-old now when he says, oh, no, oh, no, I say, no, I, I don't say that word. <laughs> Mommy doesn't like that word. And he, he catches himself. But I notice the N word is everywhere. So beware of the nice word parasites all over. They're being sneezed all over the place. <laughs> yeah, you, you don't like 
certain thoughts about sexual things being sneezed all over you, well, <laughs> you have no idea what words are. You can't see anything besides that all of the distractions are right in front of you. I can't tell you because you probably wouldn't believe how real the distractions are. Oh, this is a virtual reality game. Super game now. Super game. You just have to be present. And wake up. Wake up. Find yourself. It's real, but it's not. That's the game. That's what we're supposed to do.